Austin police are putting a stop to drivers who blow through crosswalks. It's an initiative to make the city safer for pedestrians and to cut down on the number of deadly accidents. KXN's Omar Lewis is live downtown with more on this story. Omar. We're here on South Congress Avenue, one of the places that police officers that were dressed in plain clothes set up to catch drivers who blow through cross socks just like this one. Pedestrians we talked to today say walking the streets in Austin can be a scary and dangerous experience, which is why the police department is stepping up to make some changes to, to what's going on. They say that the, um, the APD has officers dressed in these plain clothes that spot the violations while officers on motorcycles pull them over. A few of the places officers were station today were along Barton Springs Road, North Lamar Boulevard, as well as Red River and 12 Streets. There are some, these are some of the areas that APD says has the most accidents so far this year. There have been seven fatal accidents involving pedestrians and one bicycle fatality. Pedestrians we talked to today say they're glad APD is, APD is doing something to fix this growing problem. I think it'd be a great idea for the cops to step in and take some action and really enforce the laws because pedestrians, I feel, should always have the right of way. And today, today was a really successful day for officers. They, they say that they pulled over 36 people that were caught not yielding to pedestrians. Two pedestrians were cited for disregarding the walking signals, and 10 people received warnings. APD says this initiative can go on for however long it takes for them to feel that the streets are once again safe. For now, we're live in South Austin. Omar Lewis, KXAN News. Omar, thanks. Community leaders focused on the health of Central Texas children unveiled a new set of maps today showing where children are getting hurt most in transportation accidents. Here is one example. This is a map of the 11 spots where the most children on foot or bicycle were hurt by a vehicle in Austin. You can see the hot spots all across town. But the area of most concern is the neighborhood around Old Torf and Burleson Road, followed by spots around IH-35 in North Austin.